Uh, there is a bit of a, of a vocal cadence and a rhythm uh, that uh, Mr. Disney had. It took a while to figure out. But a lot of the, the, the little anecdotes we found specifically from the likes of uh, Richard Sherman and were already in the play, for, uh, in the screenplay. For example, like uh, Walt's cough. Uh, you know, Walt, Walt smoked three packs a day, and Richard Sherman, right, and was was at the screenplay as well. Is that you? You knew. He said you'd always knew when Walt was coming to a visit your office because you could hear him coughing, you know, from down by the elevator. So you're able to put that kind of stuff into it, and it just ends up being, you know, one of the delightful cards in the deck. Emma, for you, I like that you use breadcrumbs. Because <laughs> <laughs> I think most people think of Caesar's and the Minotaur, and the fact that P.L. Travers was so fascinated with myth and was a searcher all her life. So it was very breadcrumby, my search for her. Um, she went everywhere you can imagine to. She was like going into a maze. You know, and, and around some corners you'd find this terrible monster and around another corner you'd find a, a sort of beaten child. So she, she was the most extraordinary combination of, of things. And I suppose that was the scary thing because in films, I don't know whether the, my colleagues would agree, but we often get to play people who are emotionally or at least morally consistent in some way. And she wasn't consistent in any way. So she, you, you would not know what you would get from one moment to the next, so that she, you could have had a very close moment with her on one day. And I got this from her friends. And then the next day, they might have gone to see her and she would have treated them as if... It's like that moment that Kelly created and invented with Paul Giamatti's character, where she says, you know, you're the only American I've ever liked. And he says, oh, really? How fascinating. Why? Can, will, you, can, will you tell me why? And she says, no. <laughs> I don't want to tell you any more about that. Now you're just asking too much. Go away. <laughs> and you know what you do with breadcrumbs, don't you? You feed the bird.